Egypt's appellate court has ordered the retrial of longtime dictator Hosni Mubarak, his two sons, and former interior minister Habib al Adli, who is also serving a life sentence in prison. Analysts believe that the ruling threatens to unsettle Egypt once again, just as political parties have ended their battle over a contentious constitution and as they prepare for the upcoming lower house parliamentary elections. If um, the court is going to retry Mubarak once more, uh, it can also have a more severe judgment or it can also alleviate or reduce the judgment that it had been rendered before by the uh, the criminal court. Many here have expressed their dismay after the cassation court accepted the appeal of the deposed president and his aides. We want a revolution against the judiciary because it's made up of corrupt judges who want to ruin the country. On another front, some hope that the retrial of the symbols of the previous corrupt regime will pave the way for new evidence to unfold as it could lead to a harsher verdict on those who many contend have played a key role in killing peaceful protesters during the 2011 Egyptian revolution. There is new evidence and there are already new events that are unfolded and the crimes that were committed by the previous regime and were missed in the previous trial. The prosecution said the retrial will let them present a stronger case for murder by using fresh evidence that the deposed president ordered the killings of protesters. Even though Mubarak is set to get a new trial, it remains to be seen whether this ruling will affect the demonstrations planned for January 25, the second anniversary of the revolution, which led to the ouster of Hosni Mubarak and his regime. Karim Gamaleddin, Press TV, Cairo.